Hey fellow travelers, welcome back to Travelmoji. In today's video, together we'll explore the top 10 things to do in Milos Island. Milos is a volcanic island in the Aegean Sea, which is rumored to be the largest and the most beautiful Greek island of all. The latter part is definitely not a lie. The island with rich geological history leaves you with quite many breathtaking landscape photos in your gallery. There are numerous sites to visit which will make you feel free of your busy life and witness a lot of memories to take back with you. The island has numerous remote beaches which are suitable for your candlelight dinner plans with your partner or maybe spending time with your family on the beach on a bright sunny day. Milos Island is a go-to option. There is not just one or two beaches but nearly 10 to 15 remote beaches waiting to be explored by you. With its picturesque alley, lovely shops, fancy restaurants and ancient ruins, Milos Island keeps you excited throughout the trip. Before we get into the video, make sure to check out the link in the description for the secret way to book a flight at the cheapest price possible. If you're planning your trip to Milos Island, then make sure to watch this video till the end to find out the number one spot here. And also, if travel makes you happy, then don't forget to subscribe to our channel and click the bell icon so that you never miss any updates. So without any further ado, let's get right into the video. Number 10. Milos Mining Museum Though it might sound a little boring, no place is entirely traveled until you dive into the history of the place you're visiting. If you want to know a little more about the history of Milos Island, you have to visit the Milos Mining Museum. In today's world, Milos is the largest processor and also producer of many minerals and elements. The museum tour will give you an idea of the story of their success behind it. A visit to the museum in the afternoon sounds like a good plan. If you like museums but not just about mining, then there's also Milos Archaeological Museum, which you can pay a visit to if you're into archaeology. Otherwise, feel free to enjoy your day in the alluring beaches and bright alleys. Tripiti Village There are so many beautiful villages in Milos Island. Some have colorful houses amidst the white rocks. Tripiti Village is a traditional one which beholds the ancient culture of the Greek. The view of the sun setting over the harbor of the island leaves you breathless. And it's also just a walking distance away from the Placa Castel and the Catacombs and you can plan the visit to either of them according to your convenience. But don't worry, we will discuss these in the latter part of the video. Number 8. The Placa Castel this is one of those places on Milos Island that you just cannot miss. It was a refuge from pirate attacks. On traveling up, you will be at the top of the second highest peak of Milos. You will get the fascinating panorama of the entire Milos Island once you get to the top. But the stairway to the roof gets remarkably crowded in the evening, and the locals and the tourists rush to witness the enchanting sunset views. So, be an early bird and get to the top to view the scenery you will fall in love with. Number 7 Cocktail and Acri Bar 
One of the famous bars in Milos is mostly visited for the view it offers during the evening. Traveling and visiting places is not just to run around chasing monuments and walking in the museums, but also to sit and watch the busy world from afar. Acri Bar gives you just that. A glass of cocktail, music in the background, and an awe-inspiring view to lose your mind into. Isn't that what we daydream of every Monday in the office? Number 6. Catacombs of Milos These impressive catacombs are built from volcanic rocks. It's not an everyday occurrence that we get to visit the burial ground, so make use of the chance, it's worth your time. Just two sections of the catacombs are allowed for the tourists to visit and that's more than enough to leave an impact on you. Catacombs of Milos were the early Christian monuments to worship secretly and also the burial ground of all of Greece. The inscriptions on the walls date back to over 500,000 years, and they will surely make you wonder about the history of mankind. Number 5. Paliorema It's one of the only beaches which is not easy to reach or travel to. You'll be traveling through dirt tracks or rugged hills, but rough paths take you to beautiful destinations and one such is Paliorama. While the other beaches are just for sunbathing and skydiving, Paliorama offers so much more to drone into. It holds the history of sulfur mines. At the site, there are more tunnels to explore and cave houses to admire, and lots of sulfurs in the rocks. Number 4. Ancient Theater of Milos Just the location and the picture of it can make you run to this place. Not further than 300 meters from catacombs is the Ancient Theater of Milos, with 7,000 seats in a natural backdrop of the island harbor. The seats are made of pristine marble. The hills on the right side and facing the harbor, the Ancient Theater of Milos is a great place to propose to your better half. Go for it if you are searching for such a location. Number 3. Boat Tour Around the Milos What's a tour to an island without boating? Take a boat tour to Rome around the Milos. Mostly all the boat tours begin from the village of Adamas and it takes you along the long shoreline of the Milos Island and the showstopper is Kleftiko. There it also allows you to swim around the small caves and lets you witness the astonishingly strange rock formations. And you can also sign up for scuba diving sessions on the island if you're so excited to try. This is the time. Number 2. Cave of Sikia Sikia is another place you can only visit by boat. The Sikia is a collapsed cave and due to its irregular shape and also to offer you the opportunity of diving into the sea, you'll be switched to travel in the rigid inflated boats. The color of the sunset on the white rocks of Sikia Cave makes it an effortlessly beautiful scenery. Sarakiniko Beach Saving the best for last, Sarakiniko Beach should be a must-visit place. No list of Milos is complete without visiting its beaches and specifically, Sarakiniko is a must. It's the top favorite of almost all. It's crystal clear water, breathtaking landscapes of sunrise and gorgeous sunsets that puts your wanderlust soul to rest. With milk-white rocks at one side where tourists sunbathe and rest their day and the beach on the other end, 
Sadaka Nikyo gives an out-of-the-world experience and feelings. The disorganized shapes of the white rocks give a feeling of moonscape. The blue-green seam calming your senses, I bet you'll fall in love with Milos once you visit Sadaka Nikyo. On prying into the history, the locals of the beach are more welcoming and friendly than any other place. They even helped some shipwrecked pirates to build their ships. Don't forget to click picturesque selfies in the combo of white rocks and the blue-green sea. It's the best option to spend your day with your loved ones. You can also try diving if you're a fan of water sports and thrilling adventures. Sarakuniko Beach is not the only one. If you love the ambience of the beach, plan to get more tanned and want to visit one more, then there's not just one but nearly around 50 more small and big beaches on Milos Island that end up being the favorites of many tourists. So pack your picnic bags and spend your time with the waves of the turquoise water of beaches like Firopotamus Beach, Paliokori Beach, Sigrado Beach, and the Firiplaka Beach.